All right, so another project that I wanted to undertake. I have a BOA 265B model remote starter on my truck. And I wired it in years ago. And yeah, it's crappy wiring, all of these wires are all that. The remote starter for it, I don't know where it is, it's not here, but essentially it's uh, shorted out. So, I was going to hook up a Raspberry Pi to it to figure out if I could just activate it remotely through the Raspberry Pi using Wi-Fi. And I figured out I can. So, this cable right here, this is the white blue. And normally it was capped. There it is right here. So, I've loosened that. This is the trigger for the whole thing. So all I gotta do is take this cable, ground it twice, tap, tap. <whistles> Triggers and starts the whole system. So now my truck is running. And if I want to turn it off, do the same thing. Tap. And it shuts off. So Tap, tap, you hear it click, tap, tap, click, it's on, my battery's getting low, so now I just need to go grab a Pi, do some programming on a relay interface, and uh, I'll show you what that looks like. All right, so here's the setup. Uh, this is the guy I'm working on here. I got a Wi-Fi card that's gonna be set up in an access point mode. Ethernet is not gonna be used at all. Currently, he's updating himself. And I have a script here. This is the script to update. Um, Here's the script to create the web page. Here's the Python script. So it's slowly uh, coming together. This is the relay board. This is an eight way relay. I'm only actually going to use one. So it's kind of stupid. I do have a Pi face. I'm not going to use him. And then I have a spare relay here. I'm not going to be using either. Um, so once he's configured, this is a 8 gig SD. Uh, I'm actually going to take these out. This was, was being used for a motor controller. I'm going to take that out. And it's going to be default uh, open and then when I push the relay, this guy will close. I'll show you that once I get the code already. Then I just gotta figure out how to put it on a board and get it together. I'm gonna put a LED light that goes off when everything's on, or maybe tie that into the parking lights or the headlights or something. Let's see. Oh, and this. will be used for, I'm going to put it inside the truck, so when I get in I can just double click it and it will start automatically. So it's like my own little arcade game push start. Alright, so here's what I have so far. So I'm using this 5 volt here. And this ground is here, so 5 volt in ground, and I'm using GPI pin 11. And it comes in positive and negative, positive and negative. So this pin, this one, comes in to there, and I come out onto the relay board. Positive. Negative pin one. 
So the code, you can't see this very well. So the code is actually this Python script. So that's better. So here's where my script actually initiates the board, enables pin 11, waits for half a second, turns off pin, waits for half a second, turns it back on, waits for half a second, turns it back off. So and then my stop. does just the opposite. It only turns it on once, waits half a second, and turns it off again. So if I run them through here, if I do pi um, start once I hit it, I hit it now. Turns it on, turns it off, turns it on, turns it off. So it's going to be grounding it, and not grounding it, and then grounding it again. And stopping it. And this will be stop. And it turns it off once. So then I have this run PHP script, oops, there. That turns it on, I copied some other guys. Then I run that, this is for an LED. Then I run this. And then it turns it on, turns it off there. So I do this. So if I hit this one, I hit the one. There it goes. So now I just need to go put it in the truck. So this is utterly difficult to show. But from a, I just mounted the pie and all that stuff right there under the dash. So yeah, it looks terrible. But I need access to it for a little while until I make sure that this is what I want. So this is the white blue cable off of the rem, the BOA remote start. This black one goes to the ground up there somewhere. This black one ties into that ground. So I'm going to connect this one here to this first relay. And then this relay is going to hop twice and turn it on. I've already tested it. It works. So I just need to connect it now. And then I need to get power to the Pi somehow.